Next, I'm going to discuss about the dry end method of this program. So if you debug the code, control comes to main function here after that coincide. So I have taken all uh, three integer variable. First is n, second i, and next flag. So I have a flag value in is raised to zero. So I have a cout. So what do I double code that display into the output screen? Enter positive number. So I'm going to enter uh, n value five. So whatever I'm going to enter, so that received by n. So at a i value start from two. Now i less than equal to n by two. So five by two. The value come two. So two equal to two. Condition is true, so that coincide. So if n mod i, pi mod or uh, two, double equal to zero. So if you divide pi mod two, then our uh, remainder come at you one. So one double equal to zero. Condition is not true. That not coincide. So at here that increase the value of i. So i is three now. So three n by two. So this value is now. Five by two, two. So three less than equal to two. Condition is not true, so that not coincide. Now control comes to this point. If flag double equal to zero, so flag value is uh, zero now. So that coincide. At here, if part or uh, that display prime number is or uh, n value five. Suppose if I enter n value eight, so I do. I start from two again. Check the condition i less than equal to n by two. So eight by two, the value come four. Two less than equal to four. Condition is true. So if n mod i, so eight mod two double equal to zero. So eight mod two. The value remainder come zero, so zero equal to zero. Condition is true, so that coincide. So at your flag become one. Now a break statement comes, so that terminate the loop and control comes to this point. So if flag double equal to zero, so flag value is now one. So condition is not true, so that go to else point at here. That print not a prime number and value eight, not a prime number. Eight. Suppose if I enter nine, so right here, I less than equal to nine by two. So I divide by four times. So the value come nine by two four. If n mod i double equal to zero. So right here nine mod two double equal to zero. So nine mod two remainder come one. One double equal to zero condition is not true. So that not coincide. That increase the value of i. So i is three now. Check the condition three less than four, three less than equal to four. Condition is true. So if n mod i, so nine mod three double equal to zero. So nine mod three remainder come zero. So zero equal to zero. Condition is true. So flag become one and at here. Or oh, now break statement comes so that terminate the loop and control comes to this point. So at here if flag double equal to zero or oh, one. Oh, sorry. If flag double equal to zero, so flag value is now one. So that not go to a point. Control comes to else point, and that display not a prime number nine. Like this, you can test to other number like fifteen. So this is a not a prime number. Seventeen. This is a prime number. And do the dry run method like this. So you will get 15 is not a prime number, 17 is a prime number. So this is the dry end method of this program. So I hope guys do understand. So thanks for watching. See you next week.